I go home and watch videos, very little videos, probably like two or three rounds, that's it, because I get bored of it. Yeah. Uh, I don't like think about the fight. Uh, that's Robert's job, that's uh, Robert and Don's job. They look at the fight, they, they come to the gym and they tell me what to do and everything. That's what I do. But I just like to go and enjoy and have fun, you know? And then when I start walking to the ring, that's when the little butterflies and everything starts hitting me. Like, oh, fuck, fight time now. You gotta switch the, switch the mood, switch the mode, and get ready to fight. My, I gotta get the, not the happy face, I get the gang face on and the mad face and get ready. What, what does it feel like? Because only a certain number of people know how it is to come out of that tunnel. You know how it feels like. What does it feel coming out of that tunnel seeing all the fans? Is that a feeling you can never describe? Uh, here in the States, I love it. I love it because, you know, I have everybody rooting for me. It's badass. In China, you know, I think it's going to be a hit majority of his people. But, you know, it's okay. Uh, it feels good, though. You feel good. You're, like, ready to give on the show. You're like, fuck yeah, it's time to get in that <laughs> ring. I don't know. You know, I walk in the ring. I can hear everybody screaming. But when I get in that fucking ring, it's a trip. How I can avoid everybody around me. All my surroundings, everybody noise. I can just block it off. And the only person I hear is this fucking guy. That's the only guy I can hear is Robert screaming at me, telling him what to do. But out of everybody else, I can block it off and I can hear this. That's pretty amazing. That's, I can't believe that's a, that's a trip. That's the way it was when I was fighting. When I was fighting, I always I always just listened to my corner, which was my dad. I never heard the crowd. I never heard anything the crowd was saying. There was one one time, well, against against Corrales, where I kind of I, I I wasn't you know my concentration wasn't there, and I was hearing the commentators and I was hearing yeah. everything going around. And wow. nah, I got fuck, I got knocked the fuck was out. Was Max Kellerman there? No, no, it was, that was uh, Showtime. You know what? I and I got dropped. Like, like, yeah, like, I was. I heard everybody face. around me. Oh shit! And I got dropped oh. twice in the first round. I barely survived that round, but I knocked him on the fifth round because that's when I came back to the corner and Robert set me down. I had to calm down, and then he. And I was like, fuck. So I calmed. I relaxed. That's how I heard him, and that was it. So it is a lot of mental stuff, and you have it, to, you have to deal with it. It's mental. It's mental for, like, to hear your corner. That's it. It's not mental that, like, oh, fuck. Oh, I'm going to get fucked up. There's no. It's mental, like, I'm going to go in the ring. I, I, the only person I can hear, the only person that's going to give me instruction is this guy. 